In this short video, I'm going to show you how to use templates in Pinnacle Studio. I'm not going to show you how to make them, just how to download other people's templates and to modify them for your own use. First off, you'll need a template to work with. Go to the DTV Pro website and select the free templates page. The one I've used at the beginning of this video was a modified version of the template Cycling News. Download that to your Downloads folder following the instructions on the page. How do you load a template? It has a different file extension to a normal project and the easiest way to load it is to use the Open option of the File menu and select the correct file type from the drop-down, either Studio Projects, which shows you all types, or Studio Templates. If you now select it, it will appear on the timeline. There are two important things about templates. Firstly, if they have been saved correctly, all the parts that you can replace will be shown as empty clips with the label placeholder. The other thing is that Pinnacle have provided a special editing mode to allow you to replace the placeholders with your own footage. Unsurprisingly, the mode is called replace. It's the last mode of the drop-down on the far right of the Timeline toolbar. Once you're in this mode, changing the placeholders to your own video sources is just a case of drag and drop. Here, I'm just using the sample footage. I'm changing the in and out points on the source viewer so as to get three different sections, but obviously you can use different clips. If the clip is too long for the placeholder, it's just truncated. All the effects and keyframes from the placeholders are inherited by the new clips. And any titles can be edited just as if they were your own titles. Note that the bits of the template that show up as black are in fact transparent. So if you place your own source below those, it will show through those parts. When you've finished customizing the template, you can save it as a movie, copy and paste it to another project, or use the Save Group as Project option to gather up all the bits and put them on one track. Now you know how to use other people's templates and their creativity. Hopefully, in the future, the Pinnacle community will make more templates for people to share.